Tuesday. Hope you're all right. You've had a nice day, whatever you've been up to today. Oh, it's chucking it down, all right? It, well, it's not chucking it down, but it's raining. And I'm happy, okay? I'm happy that it's raining. I like the sun, don't get me wrong, all right? I prefer the sun, but I'm hoping to get a good night's sleep tonight because, honestly, I've just been sweating my tits off in bed, all right? I've had the window open wide. Steve, oh, Steve shuts the window. I can't sleep with the window shut. It makes me feel really panicky. I feel like I'm not getting any air. Honestly, I can't stand it. But Steve shuts the window and he thinks putting it bloody fly. They're everywhere. All right, they're everywhere. But Steve thinks putting it on the catch or the latch. I call it the catch or the latch. I don't know. The catch. We say latch. Latch to me is when you've got your knickers up your ass. But, <laughs> you know, you pull your latch out. When you're down little, we... And it's really fucking annoying, I won't lie. So you've got to kind of make sure no one's about and, you know, yank it out. <laughs> anyway, you know, maybe not down little. But, um, oh shit. Anyway, yeah, he closes it on the catch and thinks that's like a compromise. But it's, a, it's like that much gap. And honestly, I can't stand it. I hate it. So I quite often go downstairs in the middle of the night, you know, have the back door open. Honestly, standing at the back door, just sweating it's because it's been proper muggy though it's been really piss off bloody hot so yeah i'm hoping to get a good night's sleep tonight because yeah it's raining so there's a nice breeze in the air as well so i'm happy but um i do like the sun i love the sun you know i'd much rather the sun but no we need it my grass needs it but anyway i've been to heron today so i'll show you all my bits this isn't my main shop at all this is um you know i love heron it's a my favourite shit shop, it sells shit and I like shit. So yeah, I've still got to go out and um, do like a proper food shop, all my veggies um, and all my bits and bobs. But, um, so I've got itchy back and I might have something in my teeth as well, I just realised. I am, um, when I've just that, uh, I've just that, I've just ate something that we got from Heron, shared it with Steve, so I might have the bits in my teeth, but I'll show you that in a minute. But yeah, I've got right itchy back. But um, yeah, I'm going to get into it now, so if you do want to stick around, I'd really appreciate it if you left a like and subscribe to my channel if you're not already, and I shall get on with it first bag. So yeah, I've still got to pop out 25p, so I've got four. Alright, this is pea and, pea and spinach, why have I just seen that on the back? Oh, this is how you make pea and spinach pasta, so there's a recipe on the back. This is gluten-free organic green pea pasta. All right, that's not bad, is it? So I've got four of them, high in fiber, high in protein, and one of your five a day. I don't like pasta, so I thought, well, I'm gonna try that. I can't believe it, it's 25p. That's a right bargain. So yeah, I've got four of them. You know, like I said, right bargain. I went in mainly as well to try and find any meat-free alternatives. So I don't really eat meat. I have occasionally ate meat um, since becoming like pescatarian. But um, not, it's very rare, you know, it's very rare I eat meat. Yeah, I like to go in because Erin usually have like a really good range of like meat-free bits. So I got this, which is made from soya beans. It says Paul Oomph, that's the brand, Oomph, Oomph, I don't know, is that, am I saying it right, Oomph, Oomph? It's this brand, but it actually sounds really nice. Can you hear Crash snoring, listen. He's dreaming. Yeah, you know, it's quite low in calories as well. I don't actually know what it is, really. But it was cheap. It was a quid. Um, pulled umph made from soybeans. Why does it feel weird saying that? Um, so, um, yeah, I think that'll be nice in like wraps or something. But that was only a pound. They also had these Weight Watcher bars, which were six for a pound. So they are Weight Watcher protein uh, Weight Watcher Protein Raspberry Crunch Bars. So, yeah, I got um, six of them for six for a pound. So, 74 calories per bar, you know. And then um, some Ainsley Harrier Classic Broccoli and Stilton Cup Soup, because I really like these. And they're just like nice little, I mean, it's 92 calories a session, I'm calorie counting. Um, you know, just for like. Do you know what I mean? Just to keep you going sometimes. I like it anyway. Um, broccoli and stilton is my favourite. So that's one bag. I've got these cans, which I'll show you in a minute because I've got like a in here. But um, I 
also grabbed these, right? They were eight for a pound. That's why I love Heron. I don't know what it is. But I grabbed them. I thought, oh, wait, for a pound. And when I seen 35 calories per pack, that's what did it. So one in five a day, no added sugar, vegan, gluten free. So these are 100% natural freeze dried crispy bits. So orange crispy bits. All right. Eight for a pound. Eight for a pound at 35 calories. Do you know what I mean? So this is why I love to go in because they have all kinds of shit. Half the time I don't know what it is, but eight for a pound. Do you know what I mean? These, all right, were a quid in the glass jars, them ones. They're them fancy ones. Down co op, these are oh, tenner, I'm telling y'all. So this is GU, um, blah, he wears that mousse dark chocolate with ganache. So, very nice. Look at the glass ones, quid. They had some that were 2 as well, like another two pack. And I just got to double check it until I said, I think the right ones up, haven't I? Because, you know, I went from 2 pound 49. But she was like, yeah, bargain. And then, um, honestly, just loads of like little snacky bits. Like, they're really good if you've got a heron near you for a meat free and um, like low calorie. Blah, blah, blah. Low calorie snacks. Also got these Weight Watcher shortbread thins as well. 69p, all right. 60 calories per two. I thought well, that's not bad. And then these are for Steve and the kids. So um, two for a pound they were. They've got dark chocolate as well. So hobnob, I love a hobnob. All right, it's like my favorite biscuit. I'm not gonna be eating them, but it's a, my, one of my favorite biscuits. Each biscuit is 92 calories. Um, a sticky toffee pudding. I mean, I might have one too. Don't get me wrong, but like I'm not like crazy for them. Like I'm quite content where I am at the minute with, you know, little alternatives and do you know what I mean? And then these are three for a pound. These are another low calorie snack that I found. Obviously, you have to be um, like if you are calorie counting, like checking your sugars because you know a lot of things do have added sugar. So you know you got to be careful. Um, so yeah, fruit juice in no fruit induced juice. Ju ju Alright, so this is basically fruit induced pieces piece peaches. Oh my fucking god. Alright. It's basically fruit jelly, you know. Three for a pound. I got some biscoff spread because I'm gonna be doing overnight oats and wheat so I'm gonna grab them in my main shop. That's TikTok for you. Alright, the only thing I find is the over and speak the overnight oats that i have seen they're quite calorific like for breakfast like my um oats that i have in the morning they're about 200 calorie calories with my banana so you know but i do think they look really nice it's nice to switch it up i've got these so oh you beauty they were three for a pound and i like coffee as you know i thought i'd give them a go so these ones are a slim latte so they're just like a snazzy drink, coffee, bourbon vanilla. That sounds nice. But I got both the slim ones and the full fat ones just to like see the taste difference. So um yeah, three for a pound. I thought that's not bad, you know. I like you know snazzy drinks like this every so often. Listen, oh my god, all right. If you have got a heron and you like ice cream, these little pots are three for a pound. So I got nine because they're perfect for my lads. You know, they love biscoff and they're. Three little pots, 40p each or three for a pound. Honestly, I think they're perfect, like kid size, adult size, you know. But Biscoff, three for a pound. And then, oh, these were two quid. I think I might have these for tea tonight. I need to burp. Excuse me. Um, this is part of the XL range. So two teriyaki salmon skewers. These were two quid, you know, and I love fish. So I love salmon. It can be quite pricey though, salmon. I thought these sound quite nice. So, you know, with some salad, you know, and a sweet potato or I don't know. And then um, these hemp and banana ice creams. 113 calories per one. Look at that. That's a bit snazzy. So, yeah, hemp and banana. It sounds really nice. Love anything banana, you know. I'm going to get these back in the freezer and then on to my last bag. Got some wagon wheels. You get eight in here for a quid. So I'll grab them. Um, these are plant-based um, yogurts. Well, like mousses. So by the coconut collab, chocolate and cream. 
think they sound quite nice. 139 calories per pot, and they were 69p for a four pack. And then I've got the kids some of these, they sound quite nice actually. Um, chocolate and banana pillows, £1.25. Right, these were two for a pound, but me and Steve have shared a packet. So they are Korean bites, so they're vegan, you know, you can have them hot or cold. Um, yeah, Korean bites, chickpeas and sweet potato with citrus and chilli. So they're really nice, you know, two for a quid. And this cauldron brand, they do like tofu and stuff and they're quite expensive really. So again, that's why I love herring because you just get all this snazzy stuff really cheap. Three for a pound. So this is um, like baking chocolate. So I thought, right, I'll grab that. Three for a quid. You know, I'm going to do some baking of some sort with the kids. It even tells you on the back look, it's got um, a chocolate chip recipe idea and it tells you what you need. I'm going to do that. Butter, um, caster sugar, flour, cocoa powder and these. Right, I'm making cookies tomorrow with the kids then, they'll love that. They made dinner, bless them, and they're, oh, they're just so sweet, honestly. And then I got um, six yogurts, they were three for a pound, so I love these ones. Um, I love peach, so there's some peach ones. Yeah, peach and apricot. And then the strawberry ones, so I got six, they were three for a pound. And that is everything from my heron shop. have had a degusta um, arrive today, so should I have a little look? I might have a look. So... Yeah, fuck it. Um, it's just arrived not long ago, so I'm going to open it. So yeah, Degusta have kindly gifted me their box. Um, they send it me every month, which I really, really appreciate. So I'll show you all the contents. It's a monthly um, like food subscription. You can have it as a one-off, um, or like you can continue to um, buy it, like a you know every month subscription. So um, yeah, I'm going to have a look. It feels quite heavy, so yeah, I'll link them below if you did want to try them out, but I'm going to have a little look. So this is the box. The Degusta box, it is very heavy. So they send you um like items, um, like new things, new products that might be out. It arrives like packaged like that. So let's have a look. Oh right, so you get all your um like paperwork with it as well. So they usually send coupons, yeah, coupons. I was actually going to get, it says Horlicks here, vegan Horlicks. They actually, um, no, I actually was in Home Bargains and I was going to get the kids like a oval teeny Horlicksy type drink. They just prefer hot chocolate. So, yeah, and this is what's um, in the box. So, um, back to school and relaxing evenings. So this is, um, yeah, it's got everything in the prices as well. So excited to soon be back to school honestly i know some people are due to go back to school this week actually but um yeah so they send you all the bits and bobs to look through right let's have a look my lads are gonna love this i've just got the cereal and i so this is um strawberry flavored nest quick um milkshake they'll be very happy with that i think there's more oh, i thought this was um bmbn chocolate flavored bns little biscuits um we've got some bit oh my god number one in japan it says so um beef spicy five spiced beef flavored noodles i love noodles they sound quite nice you know they do sound really nice steve loves stuff like this as well and then we've got oh a korean barbecue soy free sauce look at that that's a bit snazzy. My fridge is full of sauces at the minute. That's why I got to do the food shop. People are like, can I have something to eat? Yeah, a bit of tart sauce at the back of the fridge. Uh, we've got um, lasagna sheets. These are 20 calories per serving, four grams of carbs. Lasagna sheets, they feel very soft. They feel like pre-cooked and then a bottle of something. So this is, oh, is it cider? Pair with cheese and preserves. I think this is cider, you know. Hang on, hang on, hang on. More like a wine than a cider. Very nice. There you go, that's that. So 
you know, just sound quite nice. We have a tin of Heinz veg hoops. 30% more veg. Pasta made with carrot and cauliflower. Bloody hell. We've got some classic mayo. I've just spat everywhere then. Classic mayo. I've seen it come flying out my mouth. This is what I mean. We have so many like snazzy bits. We've got some more BNs. These are strawberry ones, mini ones. The kids are going to be well happy with these, you know. Oat like that, honestly. And then some Horlicks. So this is vegan multi-goodness. Bigger tub of Horlicks there. And then we've got a drink as well, pomegranate and blueberry. That sounds nice. And then the last thing in here is, so urban fruit, source of vitamin C, blended fruit bites, mango, pineapple, um, and other bits and bobs. So... One in five a day. That's these. So that is the Gusta. I will link them below if you want to like, check them out. Like I always say, only if you want to. That's the end of the video. I'm going to pack everything away now. I hope you enjoyed the video. I'd really appreciate it if you left a like. just spat again. Sorry, I'm just like everywhere. <laughs> I'd really appreciate it if you left a like and subscribe to my channel if you're not already. And um, yeah, as always, my friends, don't let any dickheads get you down, alright? Know your worth, okay? You're amazing, alright? Don't forget to take time out for you, yeah? Recharge big deep breaths okay just have a minute all right just know your worth i love y'all and i'll see you in tomorrow's video